boom fewer subscribers but i get my these quick updates because trust if it's not for and from king mix up it's not credible i keep on telling you that you got to keep up with me if you want to hear from me and you don't know the things that i've been uploading videos on my boom by by tv channel you feel what i'm saying trying to get back into the spirit of things and you don't know the things that dance all boring and i just can't Feed on the garbage, you see me, I say. But nevertheless, people, let's get into what we see on the headlines because trust. Now, it's not a good look for the holdness. Yes, whether a yard or abroad, you feel what I'm saying? And I'm pretty sure you're saying, kick mix up. Why is that oldness get arrested? Chill, just listen. You feel what I'm saying? Put in the comment section if you can find any connection to Andrew Holness and the daughter of a prominent Jamaican politician in Florida. Yes, because that the politician there, that was arrested on federal charges. The United States government has brought federal fraud charge against the daughter of prominent Jamaican born Florida politician Damara Holness. Yes. 28 was arrested and charged with fleecing some 300,000 US dollars from the federal government program that is meant to help struggling small business during the pandemic time. You see me, I said? She appeared, appeared in court on Wednesday and was granted bail in the sum of 100,000 US dollars. Miss Holdness was charged with one count of, of conspiring to commit wire fraud she is accused of lying about financial needs of her consulting businesses located in the plantation florida to qualify for a paycheck protection program loan and we all know that as ppp loan her father who you see on the screen um, dale holness is the current broward county commissioner and is slated to run the january 2022 special election to fill the congressional seat left vacant by the death of alec hastings he is one of 10 candidates who is seeking to be elected to the congressional seat and you don't know the things that people he is distancing himself from his daughter as he should because him said that they've been estranged for some years now but we don't know how true that is. You see what I'm saying? Um, according to the com criminal complaint filed in the Fort Lauderdale Federal Court last year when Damara Harris, I mean Holdness, was serving as president of Broward County Democratic Black Caucus, she applied for a 300000 U.S. dollar loan for her company, Holdness Consulting, Inc., the U.S. government said that in her application, Holdens claimed that her company employed 16 people and spent an average of 120 U.S. a month on payroll. But the U.S. Pro U.S. government is claiming that she has no employees, no payroll expenses, and used fraudulent payroll tax forms um, to support her loan requests. A bank in Georgia, which reviewed her company's application, approved the loan and wired 300000 to her accountants. Yeah, to our account, you know what I mean? But her lawyer, Sue Ann Robinson, said, like everyone, Miss Holness is entitled to the presumption of innocence. The Mara Holness was among thousands of Florida businesses that turned the federal PPP loan um, assistance during the pandemic, you know what I mean? Why, people? It, it, it's sticky to know that these people is being around these people. And I'm talking about politicians like the vp kamala harris you see what i'm saying cha -cha. i hope i hope the homegirl wasn't doing all of this for these chanel bags and gucci bags and you know taking expensive trips and all of these things but like i said people the streets is talking and we don't know if what the streets is saying about andrew holdness relationship to dale holdness um but the streets are saying that they are distant cousins. You feel what I'm saying? And I try to search the internet for any connection between the two. But me couldn't find none. You see me? I said, but I know you street detectives is out here. I don't know going to be on the case. You see me? I said, cha cha. The only thing I could find was Andrew Holness congratulating um, his fellow Jamaican for becoming the first of its kind for. Um, 
Broward County. As you can see, he put it upon him Facebook and upon him Twitter. You see me? So I'm just giving them updates with that case there. Let's proceed. Boy, 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 my people, I'm not gonna lie that that story uh, um, is quite interesting and the video is even better. You see what I'm saying? If you don't know, um, <laughs> people, go over to my Twitter page if you want to see the nastiness that I go on with these adults while they was at some teacher's conference. You feel what I'm saying? Yes, they was having SEX live in a Zoom meeting, as you can see. The headline, you feel what I'm saying? Teaching in the middle of a pandemic is hard. Jamaican teachers conference on Zoom turns into 18 plus live SEX broadcasts. And I'm going about to read you what um, the article has to say because it went into detail, you feel what I mean? And I've been practicing. Professional hardship became a highlight at a Jamaica's teachers conference as one of its members was caught getting intimate with a partner while her colleague was talking about necessary con connections during a public Zoom call. A recorded motile member Zoom meeting from the 57th annual conference of the Jamaica's Teachers Association has gone viral in an almost two minute long video circulating on Twitter. One of the call members window showed SUL intercourse recorded by another conference um participant the two people can be seen apparently having sex in the bedroom while a female voice is delivering a speech saying teaching in the middle of a pandemic was hard she keeps on talking about how important this profession is and distant teaching challenges i never taught online didn't know what it was while her unaware colleague continues getting intimate with a partner in front of the camera a computer voice notification recording in the progress can be heard with a different conference member screaming out loud what the hell and calling to someone to stop it and like I said, people, the, the video is even more interesting because the people them say we need necessary connections afloat. The speaker keeps on talking as the woman can be seen leaning forward to a naked partner interrupting the unintended home video. A strict face of a woman, apparently a conference host from what looks like an official venue, then appears in another window. I'm not gonna lie, people. That was the scariest part of the video. You see what I'm saying? The peep that the lady that looked at the, the, the video looked like the DPP of Jamaica or Asclot. And you can know this thing went super viral because all RT news, not read a fish boy, you know, spice fake read a fish friend, you see what I'm saying? But they said the Jamaican teacher is not the first to embarrass herself during a Zoom call which has become a new reality for many and um, things and things accidentally revealing more than what was intended. People, I'm just like giving them quick updates. I don't know the things that subscribe to my next channel. Make sure the notification bell up on that channel as well because we're about to fling up our next um, update. You feel what I'm saying? Yes. So I just wanted to advise one of that the wholeness them. Not looking good, whether yard or blood clot, broad, you feel me? Involving at some PPP, blood clot, scamming business, you say it. So, put in the comment section if there's any relations by blood um, with these wholenesses, you see? Yeah, and bless upon yourself. Out. Oh.